It was not the morning to wake up to chaos, vomiting. It just, it wasn't. Hey guys, and welcome back. I'm gonna shut this door for a second. Um, if my voice echoes, I'm in the bathroom. Nick is still sleeping. Um, this is my bachelorette party weekend, night. Um, my friend's bachelorette party that I went to last year, it was like the whole weekend. Like we started on Friday and didn't end until like Sunday afternoon. Mine's only gonna be a night because nobody has time for that. Um, our plan is to go clubbing on 6th Street in Austin tonight. And so that little part of this video will unfortunately be all on our phones because the last thing I want is this camera getting stolen, but I'm gonna take you guys along for my day. Um, and then into tonight, I have a couple of things I need to get done today. Um, I unfortunately woke up to chaos vomiting up a stick that she ate at the dog park last night. And so I really hope that's why she's throwing up. She did eat one of my scrunchies, but she has since pooped them out and I'm not missing anymore. So I'm putting some dry shampoo in my hair because I don't intend on really showering today. Um, maybe showering tomorrow. I'm pretty sure I'll change my mind as the closer I get to the afternoon. I'm also very groggy right now and I'm not drinking coffee until well afternoon. So I make sure that I am awake for this bachelorette party. I just sprayed some dry shampoo in my hair. Um, so this is what's going on basically today. Um, I need to go and look for a possible bachelorette outfit. I think I know what I want to wear, but after stepping outside, I just wonder if it's going to be too cold to wear what I want to wear. I need to find earrings to wear for my wedding itself. I need to go and pick up a bag of food for chaos, which is unrelated to this bachelorette party, but she is literally out of food. I do not have her get, not have um, enough food to even feed her dinner tonight. So I need to go and get her a bag of food. I need to go pick up my dress, my wedding dress from my friend's house and hide it in my car. Um, and then after everything is said and done, I'm packed, I'm ready to go. I've either like jumped in the shower to just kind of like rinse off, wash my face. Um, I'm gonna take everything, pack and head to my parents' house. At my parents' house, I need to try on my dress and make sure it still fits, um, as well as take probably my boots down there just cause. Um, and then I have to head to Pflugerville, which is where my friend lives. And that is where we're going to be staying the night and then partying later. So there's so much going on. I'm so tired and groggy right now. And I'm trying to let this dry shampoo sit in my hair. Um, but yeah, I plan on it being a fun night. I just didn't start off the day too great, but I'm gonna take you guys along with me for like my day and what I'm like doing and then going and partying. I also add, because <laughs> I forgot, I might as well just say this. This is my bachelorette party. I'm actually getting married next weekend. Um, so this is my last little bash. I intend to have a lot of fun. And then the stress will be taken off of me because luckily Nick is completely off tonight. Doesn't have military, fire department, none of that. And so he can watch the dog and I'm just, I'm ready to have a fun weekend. So I'm so glad to take you guys along with me. Well, I just realized I'm like done kind of getting ready. I just realized that like nowhere I want to go to is going to be open until 10. So I'm going to have to hang out for the next like 45-ish minutes. I would go ahead and start packing this morning, but I don't know like if I end up packing the outfit that I want to wear, that I think I'm going to wear and end up finding another one. So I'm just going to hold off on packing and I'm still on the fence of whether or not I'm going to shower before I leave or just, you know, tomorrow morning because we are going to be drinking and probably drinking very heavily. So just make sure you stay with your friends. You guys stay safe out there. Um, beware of your surroundings if you're drinking. And um, yeah, I intend for it to be a fun day, but I just made a list of everything I need to do on my phone. And now I just got to wait like 45-ish minutes to head out unless Kohl's is already open because I will gladly go there but I know that even PetSmart isn't going to be open they're actually open right now so I could technically go ahead and go to Kohl's decisions decisions <laughs> Hey!
I am essentially all packed. I need to fold up that blanket right there. Not that one, that one. Um, it's like really big and I need a blanket. Um, my pillow, I need to put this in my suitcase. It's just a pair of spare leggings in case I think it's just, it's too cold to go with what I wanted to do short wise. Um, but yeah, I'm essentially done. That's covered because I do have alcohol in there and we, we want to be YouTube friendly now. Um, I, I think I'm going to cave and I'm going to go ahead and shower, just kind of go over my legs with a razor, um, microblades. I meant to grab microblades while I was out. All right, never mind. I think I'm going to nair my face as well. Um, just go ahead and do that because I forgot microblades. So, Amy. Um, I'll have to get them next week for the wedding, but um, they were to take off this upper part without having to chemically take it off. Um, but I guess now I'm going to have to nair my face as well. So I'm going to go ahead and do that because it's pushing towards noon. I'm completely packed. Everything just needs to go in my car. I need to get coffee, go to Georgetown. Same plan as before. Um, I'm still on the fence of whether or not I want to get my hair wet just because my hair is really greasy right now. But because I want it braided tonight, I think it'll hold better if I just kind of leave it be. So I'm going to shower, wash my body, um, go over everything with a razor again, and then I will figure out what I'm doing after that and get all that last minute stuff put into my suitcase. Also, I'm going to wear this there. Um, I just, y'all, Adidas pants and this like ring um, t-shirt from when I got my class ring from Tarleton. So I'm, I'm, I'm going in this. I, it's, it's cold outside. It's cold outside. So, um, this is what I'm going to wear there. I'm going to end up changing. So yeah, I was, I really wanted to wear my bride shirt that I got for the reception, but I want Nick and I's outfits to be a surprise to everybody whenever we show up to the reception because I don't think only like a handful of people know that we're showing up in matching like sweatsuit outfits so um are you gonna take a shower with me you gonna take a shower with me huh hmm why do you look guilty are you guilty of something <gasps> what are you guilty of She is too funny, but yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a shower. I feel kind of gross. And then also I won't have to take my face wash with me if I go ahead and like wash my face while I'm here. So yeah, let's go take a shower and finish packing. <laughs> Excuse this like little shiny ring around my face. I just put on some hyaluronic acid lotion because um, I forgot my microblades. I had to use Nair and get the hair off around my face just because I was going to wait to do this right before my wedding. Um, but because I forgot the microblades, the hair needed to go. It is so noticeable with makeup on. So it had to go. The solar eclipse is happening outside and it looks like it's just, it's really hard to explain. It looks like a, um, an optical, y'all can't see it, but it almost looks like, looks like, can't talk today. It almost looks like an optical illusion outside how dark it is. Um, but at the same time, it is still so bright. I personally can't see it. Um, so I would videotape the eclipse going on, but I, I can't see it. I can't catch it on my camera. So the eclipse is happening. Pretty cool. I need to finish putting some of this like stuff into my suitcase. Um, I'm just kind of gearing up to go. I'm all nice and showered. Yes, I put the same clothes back on. I've only been wearing them for two hours. I'm all lotioned up. My face is going to be pretty agitated probably for the next two or three hours. So my face showing maybe a little bit limited for a while, um, but I do need to finish packing um, and then head to Georgetown because I still need to try on my dress and get to my bachelorette party on time. I'm gonna hide my scrunchies because the dog is eating them. But yeah, I am almost ready to go on the fact that I just need to put the rest of the stuff in my suitcase. I wanna wait until Nick gets back from the store and then I'll probably, 
probably head out. So. Yeah, it feels 
see the view of the camera um, but anyway it is the next day clearly I am back home <sighs> what a night what a night um, I will insert you know pictures before this clip um, if you guys see um, I did not take my like filming camera with me I was not about to lose it we had such a blast we only went to probably two bars but we were out until almost two in the morning um, we got back and we continued just to hang out for the night um, I did not film the morning after because none of us were in good shape when we woke up um, my maid of honor left really early in the morning um, and then Oh, my poor friend Jason was just passed out all morning and then I was worshiping the, uh, the porcelain god for a while. So um, I am feeling much better now. I'm exhausted. I'm tired. The last load of laundry is in the washer um, because I just mixed everything together to leave. And so I had so much laundry to do when I got back. It's a mess in here from all the stuff I brought back, but y'all, I had such an amazing time. I can't wait for you guys to see these videos. I'm hoping to get them up quite quickly because before this video, I had a paralegal video um, and then a bachelorette party. And then you guys will see my wedding in the next couple weeks. I'm hoping and I stress hoping um, to have at least these videos done by Friday hopefully afternoon and just have them post over the weekend while I'm getting married and then I'm also going to be posting after that my actual wedding um, vlog which will just be me you know getting ready going through our wedding um, highlights of our reception and stuff like that so stick around for more of that um, I am so happy that was such a blast um, my my bridesmaids are fantastic I love them I'm so grateful for them and I cannot wait to get married this Saturday. It is so, it's like, it's becoming so real for me. And so, yeah, if you guys are watching this, stay tuned for my wedding vlog that's gonna be coming out um, really soon. And yeah, it can't wait. Um, also, I think I'm gonna do like a prepping for my wedding week. Um, because this week I do want to focus, which is why I'm, these videos are going to be um, all spread out. And you probably won't see them until well after I've already been married. Um, but I intend to post the paralegal video, bachelorette party, how I'm going to be taking care of myself in the next week leading up to my wedding, and then my actual wedding itself. Um, so this week I'm just focusing on self-care, self-love, and... Yeah, so stay tuned for more wedding content. It's going to be short, it's going to be sweet, and it's going to be fast. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys when I get married. Bye.